Hi guys, welcome to my Skyways 2's video. This is Robin and Daryl, and we're getting ready to open up Jewelry Jar 220. And uh, there's going to be some other things besides the Jewelry Jar 2 I haven't told the honey about. But um, it's all going to go together. But anyway, um, if you see anything in this jar you'd like, grab yourself some. First of all, sit back and relax. And grab yourself something refreshing to drink. I'm having coffee. And uh, if you see anything in this jar you'd like, just leave a comment under the comment section of the video with a timestamp, a small description, and a price, which I'll give you in the uh, video, the price. And the description can be s as simple as silver necklace or um, blue earrings or something that identifies it because sometimes I get timestamps that are in between items. If you've not done business with me before, or if your information has changed, you need to email me at myskywatch2 at gmail.com. If you're new, uh, I will need your shipping address, your YouTube name, your full name first and last, your PayPal email if you have one. If you don't, that's not an issue. Whatever email you send me your information on will be the email I use to invoice you through PayPal. Um, we ship only in the U.S. and shipping is a flat rate of $5 no matter how much or how little you order. With that being said, all orders in May will be invoiced around June the 1st. So um, you have, uh, you can look at any of the past videos and if you see something you like and nobody's commented on it or it's not shown as sold, um, you can claim it. So that's how that works. There you go. Thank you. And we're going to get started. We have these four necklaces. That pearl. Beautiful. Multiple strands of pearl. Pretty blue floral and gold tone chain. It looks silver tone on my screen, but it is gold tone. Statement necklace. White and navy disc white bead navy disc um, necklace and this vintage necklace has the matching clip earrings here's our first one it hooks like this it's beautiful multiple strands different size pearls faux pearls I, I don't know if they're glass or not. They're cool to my touch, but that's that doesn't mean anything. Cause, um, sometimes I just can't tell because my hands are so cold. Okay, let's see. It's a 16-inch necklace. And we'll do this beauty for $5. Very pretty. The next, these are a, a plastic, they're real lightweight, beautiful floral design. I love the petals on these. Gold tone uh, curb chain, lobster claw clasp with an extender. Here's the back. You've got these felted pieces so it feels good against the uh, skin. And it, keep, it keeps it from bothering you. This one is... Fully extended, let me measure it. Fully extended, it's going to be 19 inches. And the extender on this is two and a half inches. We'll do this one for five. Very pretty. The next one. It's a vintage. It is a box clasp. It comes out like that. And it, you insert it in there and it, it clips. Beautiful white beads and a navy. And these are fluted silver tone, I mean gold tone beads. This reminds me of the 70s because I had a little dress that would go so good with this. It is 19 inches.
and we'll do this one for five. Very pretty. The next one, it, oh, I didn't realize that was broke. I don't know if I can get a clip and fix that or not. They're marked Hong Kong, and I don't know that I could get one to match. So it's going to go as is as far as the earrings. Very pretty, though. And then the necklace has got a box clasp. And which side does it come out? This side. You press down on this. It comes out. It's marked Hong Kong, which makes it very vintage. These are plastic. I love the orange and green color here. Double stranded in excellent condition. And again, the earring is, is broke. If I can fix it, I'll let you know, but I, it's going to be sold as is, and we're going to do it for $8. This jewelry jar is from our local Goodwill, and sometimes they're great, and sometimes they're not so great. Not so great. But these are the ne next four necklaces we have. I love that one with the oyster shell, and these are ammonite beads with a tassel end, and I also have a bracelet to match that. This is a little wire necklace with some. I believe wood and dyed shell and little glass beads. Lobster claw class extender with a bead. We'll do this one for a dollar. There we go. The next one is lobster claw class with an extender, and I'm going to extend it all the way. There we go. There's a little bead on the extender. Rollo chain. I love this druzy look, and I love that this is black and gold. Very pretty. It is eighteen. I'd say nineteen inches, fully extended. The extender is three inches, and we'll do this one for five. Very pretty. The next one is a nice beachy one with the oyster and the dolphin. Here's the back, and they have finished it because it's got a shine on it. These are, I think, ceramic beads and wood beads and these little glass beads here. They say 925. I don't know if they are or not. Sometimes it'll say that, and they're not. And these nice wood beads. We got a lobster claw clasp. Nice cord. We'll do this one for five. Very cute and unusual. This is a little bracelet. These are amethyst stones. And then here's your necklace. It just goes over the head. It's knotted in between each stone. Love these. Love the color. And this is like a silk uh, tassel. Very silky. In excellent condition. We'll do this set for eight. Alright, here's our next four necklaces. We have the little shell. The graduated pink bead, the shell and metal disc, and the thick chain, very bold chain. And then we have this one. It's got one part of a barrel clasp, the other part's missing. And we're going to put that in the Hobby Lot. The Hobby Lot's been claimed. That's not it. And we're still building on it. Okay, first necklace, shell necklace with uh, glass beads and barrel clasp. Just going to give it a quick measure. 
18 inches. It's a dollar. There you go, honey. Thank you. Next is, oh, a vintage class. Graduated beads. It's got gold beads in the center. I mean, spacers. And they're all in great condition. This necklace is measuring it 18 inches we'll do it for three it's an excellent condition it's pretty pink this one you have your discs that are silver and gold they're kind of two-toned because I believe some of it's worn that looks like there's one missing there I'm going to put that in the Hobby Lot because I'm not sure if there's more than one missing. The so next very large Lobster Claw Classic Silver Tone with a copper um, copper underneath because some of the copper is coming through. Even on the chain. Um, we'll put that in the Hobby Lot too. Ooh, that's very heavy. Mm -hmm. All right, we got to load up again. Okay, here we go. We've got a shell necklace with some bugle beads. Copper uh, colored necklace. Beautiful. Pretty white, opaque, and silver tone chain necklace. And then this large uh, silver tone medallion necklace. Here's your shell, your bugle beads, it's on wire. We have a lobster claw clasp. That's not on there, right? There we go. An extender with a bead. We'll do that one for a dollar. The next is... Don't put them on those things. This is copper disc with some diamond cutting where you can see the pretty uh, gold tone. This is patinaed copper here. It's turned green. Glass beads and chocolate, cognac, and honey. Lobster claw class, an extender with icing on it. Again, we have some uh, patina of the copper pieces. This necklace is fully extended. It's 19 inches. The extender is two and a half inches. And I want to test it. I don't know. I know, but I found it. So <clears throat> what did I do with it? Who knows? Lost and found. Lost and found. Well, hand me my black pen back. Yeah. It's copper. Yeah, it's copper. So that's patina on that copper. And we'll do this one for four dollars. Very cool. Hand me my pen. This? Nope. This. Yes. Thank you. Cheers. She steals my pins. And he passes at me. Lobster Claw Classic with the bead. Pretty opaque stones. They're all there. Here's the back. This looks brand new, like it's never been worn. There's no wear on it. It's a beautiful, shiny silver tone. Pretty for the uh, summer. Fully we'll extended, it is 20 inches. The extender is 3 inches. And we'll do this one for 4. 
The next one is silver tone. We have a lobster, a claw clasp, or extender with a bead. Uh, the beads have some wear on them. As you can see the copper coming through. And on these bottom ones here. Pretty medallion on that. It's a nice looking necklace. It is. It is 21 inches. And I think I'm going to put it in the Hobby Lot because of the wear on the beads here. So, and it goes. And I probably need a bigger bag. I would think so. Yeah, for the Hobby Lot. Here you go. Thank you. <laughs> okay, here's our next four necklaces. We have a pearl necklace, a Charleston, South Carolina necklace. Not Charleston, but South Carolina, yeah. the South Carolina flag. A vine necklace with pretty calves. They are light pink. It's hard to tell. And these beautiful glass beads on a wire necklace. This one's got the rhinestones um, separating it. Lobster claw clasp. Let me give you a length. 17 and a quarter inches. We'll do this one for two. They are not glass. Here is our South Carolina flag, the palm tree and the crescent moon. Sometimes people say it's the crescent that they wore on their uniforms, so I'm not sure. But anyway, there you go. Nice leather piece, and it matches the blue on this. We'll do that one for three. The next one is a vine. It's a creamy. I'm not sure if that's a peachy or a pink or just a cream. It's just hard to tell. You can see it against my skin that's pinky red. And it's on um, gold tone. It's gold tone. Lobster claw clasp extender. It is 19 inches. The extender is 3 inches. And we'll do this one for 3. And this one's very pretty. It's got a lobster claw clasp and an extender. And it's got um, wire cord. And these beautiful glass beads. These beads have an AB wash on them. Then you have these. I don't see any marks as far as 925 goes. I'm looking. Regardless, it's a very pretty necklace. And the length on this is... Nineteen and a half, and the extender is two inches. And we'll do this one for five. And we'll leave it undone, honey. Thank you. And there again, very pretty glass beads on that. Here's our next necklaces. So we have this beige necklace, and then chocolate brown necklace, and. This beautiful pendant on a cord and this beautiful statement necklace. This one's got a spring ring class, beautiful beige color. I'm going to do these two together. Then we have this chocolate one. 
They're different styles, but um, they go together like a wardrobe. We'll do both of those for three. This one had a beautiful pendant. Look at that. And you need that size to get over this snap closure. And I don't know if that's... Oh, that's marked. Yeah, 925 something. Now the neck, the pendant's not 925, but this. Oh. Exposito. Yep. It's 925. It's a snap necklace. Snaps. We'll do this one for uh, $10. This is silver. This is not. So. The next was this pretty one. It is a. I think that's JLo. It's got a little rhinestone up there. This is your extender. And she's got that little heart closure. And beautiful gold tongue curve chain. This is in excellent condition. It's like it's brand new. Never been worn. As you can see. And then let's look at these stones. Because they're beautiful pinks and yellows. And then these are peachy. Very beautiful colors. This necklace is... Give me a second. I'm going to clasp it. The extender is two and a quarter inches, and the necklace is 20 inches. And we'll do this one for seven. Very beautiful. And all oh, the stones are there. Gorgeous. Here's our next group of necklaces. We have a white beaded necklace. I don't know if that's faux pearl or not. I think it is. Necklace. Compass necklace. Very cool chain. And then this beautiful glass piece. This one has a lobster claw clasp. I mean a spring wing clasp. Nice white beads. It is uh, plastic. We'll do this one for three dollars. The next one, nice lobster claw clasp. I don't know if those. Now these are cold. I don't think they're. They're pretty. Real, I don't know if they're real pearl or not. This is heavy. These may be glass. They're so irregular, though. And they have a nice shine, but... Yeah, I'm not sure. And then these pastel... Uh, pieces between little... I don't know if they're glass or not. I don't think so. The coldness, no, they're not. They're um, acrylic, but these are cold. Very cold. It's a very pretty necklace. Let me give you a length, because you have no extender. It is 20 inches. We'll do this one for five. It's very pretty. Next we have this one, your compass, and it works. Here's the back. Beautiful chain. It's got an antique uh, gold tone look. Has a lobster claw clasp. A mono studio. Come on. 
We'll do this one for eight. Very, it's got a, a very much a steampunkish feel to it, too. That way you never lose your way. That's right. This is a pretty uh, glass pendant. I love the way the gold sparkly is surrounded by the black and then the clear. Here's the back. Nice ribbon and metallic thread. Lobster claw clasp and extender. Fully extended, this necklace is 19 inches. The extender is two inches. And we'll do this one for five. Very pretty. Okay, here's our next necklaces. A pink pearl on a cord. Red beaded. It doesn't look red, but it is very red. Mm -hmm. Apple red. Um, a brown beaded necklace. And this beauty. Sparkly. All the stones are there. Beautiful shell pieces on this. Love this color. Very soft, suede-like feel on these on this double stranded cord, lobster claw class of an extender. Fully extended, this necklace is 18 inches. We'll do it for three dollars. Very pretty. This one is red, um, spring ring class. Beautiful red beads, all the same size. And they are molded into these beads. And this one is 17 inches. And we'll do it for three. And then we have this one. Which is a lobster claw class and extender with a wooden bead. These beautiful wooden beads here. They're cold, though. And then these. All this is very cool to the touch. Very pretty necklace. Let's measure. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. I got to find these. I didn't know they'd come off. I undid it to measure it. Okay, I managed to, I forgot four here. I don't know how many were on it. I'll have to go back and look at the video. <laughs> but if there was five on there, I will keep digging until I find it. This necklace is 20 inches. This extender is three inches. It's a very pretty necklace. We'll do it for five dollars. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Nothing, honey. But I stood on the top of my head <laughs> looking for this stuff. <clears throat> One of them I found in a jar because I had an open jar down here. The other two I found around my chair. <sighs> I know. Okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> back, back on focus here. Woo. We're going to make this the finale. This is a stunner. These are your beads. Mm. Very beautiful. Here's the beautiful back. Excellent condition. You can see all the... Uh, um, foil is on the rhinestones. That makes them nice and sparkly. And then your beautiful curve chain. Lobster claw class. It's oversized with a nice bead. Let's see. The extender is three inches. And fully extended, it's 20 inches. 
And we'll do this beauty for eight. So she is a beauty. Will these be the treasured pieces of the future? The year of the statement necklaces. There we go. That's a nice one. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. Thank you uh, for uh, staying with us and watching the video. I hope you, hope you had a good time. If you did, please give us a thumbs up. Um, welcome new subscribers or just new viewers. We appreciate everybody, even those that have stuck with us all these years. And um, if you like this video and want to know we're going to put up a new one, hit that subscribe button and notification bell. If you've got friends that like jewelry, please share the video so we can grow the channel. And uh, there's always plenty of jewelry. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video. Have a blessed night. Bye now. Bye-bye.